Hello everybody, this is Old Facebook and thank you for joining me on yet another part of Let's Play Muda Master Rebirth Act 4 Make your way through Mino Via the Koshi Road, detour through Hida to avoid being ambushed by monks So yes, there wasn't a, you know, alternate path, so I didn't get to reach, I didn't get to complete this time as I would My goal was to do an act per Session <laughs> Or hour But, kind of fucked that one up Damn, that guy took the longest beating down. And it was on the plus side that I did that. I learned a few things, for example, like the hot spring shit. And the, uh... I am assuming they're based on acts and not areas or regions. But, yeah, we learned that. I got a new weapon, and, uh, but then the internet I can still fail at trials, because, you know, level caps and shit. So I'll take those. Um, Ida, where we are. Uh, this is gonna be the, uh, most... Annoying area because it's very vertical. However, it's one of the most also oh, well, I guess the old man talked at the very end of the last part these guys try to freeze you to stake your to take your soul And I thought it was in the air when I did that There we go By the way, if you're wondering why I was strength boost, I ate some cabbage. I ate some cabbage before I left. Apparently cabbage gives you strength In fact, I'm gonna cook some more cabbage Not that and I should probably start equipping this, the roasted yams. But not yet, because I know the boss we're going to fight here is pretty cool. <laughs> it's actually kind of silly too at the same time, but whatever. <laughs> You'll see. I don't need to go that way, I'm just looking for the item. I like this place, it's very... It's just snowy, it's just, they're just snowy plains, but it kind of reminds me of, of Leafry or Leafre, you know, Maple Story, which is the uh, level 120 area, or 90 to 120 area. When the fourth job advancement came out, what's the fourth job? Let's see, first job was second job was on that. No, third job was on that. Yeah, fourth job. I'm just trying to remember. So I just, you know, because I, I used to train in a snowy area where there's like dinosaurs and shit. I think it was called Lost Time, or maybe that was Papulatus, Papulatus. I don't know. I don't want the fuck. I don't know why the fuck I'm talking about Maple Story. Yes, you still saying the same damn shit. Maybe it's based on how when I reset the game. Man, I wanted those souls, not, not you're trying to take the souls from me, aren't you? Yeah, I'm leveling way too much. For my taste. I'm not a grinder. Except in Persona 4. I actually had to grind a little bit. But not because I wanted to, but because I wanted to fuse personas. I wanted the goddamn trumpeteer! Which is like one of the best personas in the game <laughs> for like part three and four because of its ability and i'm supposed to go that way and that's where my boss is like i said i didn't want to i didn't want the last part to reach over an hour so what i'm gonna do is go hit this hot spring and get those items hot springs where are you where's monkey there you are monkey baboon i guess they have red butts and I suppose that's all that matters. Sometimes you have to walk all the way to the left, but... The ones that I checked in the previous part, they didn't really have anyone in there. So, yeah. At least you get to see a moment here, must find Peach Butt. She is Princess Peach Butt. Princess... Ah, whatever. She has a princess and she has a Peach Butt. There you go. And... Another reason I don't like Chaos Roar or this this type of ability is because you cannot use it in the air. And the air is where you're the most vulnerable because you can't parry or dodge. The only choice is, is to do the, the air slash. Or the air dash, whatever. And that's your only real choice. I already got that, so why am I going over there? The green blade is not next, but that was a blue one, but could be the green one. By the looks of it, because I, I know we have to travel left. Three, huh? Oh no, it's okay, so it was two. Alright, so see you over there. And I've, I just don't understand why I should show you this shit so I get a cut out easily. Alright, continuing on. This is gonna be a battle here, isn't it? Nope, guess not. Look like a battle area. I mean, it's always obvious if I, if I ran around left and right in that one's block, I probably would have encountered one. On to the next fight. Hopefully, I can actually make 
activate pretty quick, but this is... Well, I mean, I know it wasn't a boss fight, but this is the whole, this is the whole area where it's gonna occur. Alright, so now we got the, the big pot belly fucking demons again. And once the stronger variant, and I didn't get to press triangle pressing. They're a very stalwart. Or, uh, what's the word? I was using Hazy Slash. <laughs> I thought I had Hazy Slash the whole time I wasn't paying attention. And that was almost my downfall. The strength boost it did help though. Because obviously the boss fights when there's a glowing, you know, gate or something. The last one bit me. See, look at that. It's, oh, he slashed me. Yeah, these guys are the they're, they're pretty the most. I found them to be annoying very early in the game, which is right now. But when you start encountering them again during the six act, I mean, you always encounter something different, but it's always based on where you're located. They become a lot easier by then because you have the proper. What's the word? Advanced? Nah. Proper ways of meaning to get rid of it. Yeah, this is gonna be me. There's pheasants too. That's why I bought some cabbages. Not for not just for because of the strength, but or the spirit, but because they they go with pheasants rather well. And you guys are dead. Ooh, I got a tango belt. Wait, what? I already have a tango belt. There's... Okay. Oh, well, whatever. I am wearing. I am. I do have that item that gives me more items equipped, so that could be the the case. Yeah, I'm skipping. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay, we'll skip these guys. If they're the fucking grenade throwing ninjas. I saw you. I saw you. Charging up that slash. Juggle the fuck out of you. Finalize. Aw, oh, he lived. <laughs> and I exit at the same time. How badass is that? Into another battle. How badass is that? I'm just gonna spam it because they're all bunched up. And look how weak it was. I have a lot of wheat stones. I should start selling some shit. I never really sold many things here in this stage. I knew they were sold right here. I knew it! I don't have a map for this place. It's in the foreground, isn't it? It's, uh, the item's being covered by the foreground. I'm always gonna say that because that's what I always suspect. Yeah, these guys are giving me a lot of bronze mirrors. They used to run away, but whatever. Oh no. They're used to make me get to the last save point. That's right, I'm thinking of the smoke bombs. There you are. They're hard to see in this area. I remember having a hard time fun uh, on the Vita anyways. I have a big 24 inch screen. Well, compared to the Vita. A 24 inch screen isn't that big. It's kind of the standard now in monitors or TVs. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. But anyways, I had a trouble with the Vita because, you know, white and white glow. Did not mix that well. It's kind of like using white text in a white background. Or light blue text on a white background. It's kind of stupid. You want your audience to see the text, damn it! There it is. I mean, I could make the game darker, but whatever. That would just ruin the rest of the game for me, though. Almost there. Probably should then use the skill. There we go. My save. <laughs> Damn, I'm looking at their chest. Those are fucking balloons. There's like no sag to them. That's weird. They're fake boobs. Is what they look like. I mean, I know they're drawn. They're they're quote unquote anime quote unquote anime boobs, but it looks so fake. I don't know. I hate fake tits, man. I love boobs, but I hate them with a fake. I'm gonna save for the fuck of it, because here we are into the final battle. I am gonna cook something that gives me strength, however I was thinking of making sweet potato stew. Auto recover is nice, squeak the chair. 
Okay, now that they stop moving. Uh, this would help. Miso soup would help for the boss. Um, now let's go with stewed tofu. Stewed tofu for both attack and defense. And I guess I should equip something else. Because I don't want to use this during the bottle. The bottle. The boss battle. It should be good now. Talking time. Ida, Slope Mak Takiyama. Oh, by the way, these guys are DLC. These are the ones who are the DLC for uh, Muramasa. どうするって行くしかねえじゃねえか。ここでこうやって待ってたって日が暮れちゃうだけだよ。てめえ忘れてやがるな。話したじゃねえか。この先の峠には怖い山の神様がいて旅人を組んだってよ。聞くところによると、そいつは雲を越す大入道で一つ目に睨まれたらでけえ一本足で踏みつぶされるんだそうな。しゃあ、そいつはちょいと勘弁してもらいてもんだな。おめえ、なんでこんな人気もねえ恐
この寒いのに足をむき出してどこへ行くこの先には雪入道の類がいて危ないぞよ Half naked Missy have you seen my thighs? Or a thunder dies in a good way God damn the There's Besides you're kind of like dressed like me too So yeah こっちもそいつを退治しようと来たはいいがお札が尽きたので山を降りるところじゃお主らもそうせ That's about it. Continue on with the story. Stokesai! Stokesai! Shikamo, Wakai, Musume, no Nioida. Yamao, Koyo, Tosurmon, wa, Fumitsubu, Ste, Kuro, Te, Arzo! So, here's our boss battle. Ipon, Datara! With his magnificent nipple. But yeah, you know how they're talking about tramples and Bigfoot and stepping? Well, you can probably assume what we're gonna be fighting. I found it silly, but whatever. <laughs> fighting the foot of a god. <laughs> or of a gigantic demon, whatever. Of course, I don't have the proper blade for it. But after this boss battle, or it was during this boss battle, it's when I realized. Uh, I can actually forge new blades, so hopefully this one's gonna be easy. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna rechain at all. Damn it! I didn't dash in time. Yeah, that's one of his attacks. He goes from right to left. Spam it! Ah! I forgot about this phase. Look at the detail on his fingers, man. You can see the bones. Ah! But yeah, well, you gotta get on his foot, you launch him, you fight his fist form. Oh, fuck. And you can reflect those bombs, uh, you should actually reflect those projectiles to help you out. Slap, ah, oh, damn. He was going for the punch. Yeah, if you get punched, you get knocked down, and you have to fight your way back up there again. Oh, no. There we go. Damn, that was bad. There it is. Ah! Yeah, once these projectiles come out, they get annoying. But you want to reflect it because they do the most damage. Gotta love the music for this boss fight, though. Those explosion ones are the ones you want to avoid. Because that. Just gonna let it wait out for a bit. Uh, why am I pausing? <laughs> Fuck. Damn, wrong blade too. Still using the wrong blade. Oh, I didn't get the dash in time. Alright, let me... Why can't I use my... Oh, wrong blade again! Alright, uh, I gotta get my yams out. Cause that's all I have to heal with this. Yep, thank you. Uh, and I ran right into that one. Alright. Ah, oh, I canceled the slash. Yeah, those explosions are the ones you really want to worry watch out for. There you go. Dash, please. Ah, oh, fuck. It's weird how his arm moves, but whatever, man. It's the it's just how the game is supposed to be built. Oh, yams, 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 yams. Never thought I would want yams that bad. Ah, I didn't get the double jump. Stupid heavy sword. Here comes the fist. And no, I missed. Okay, at least I reflected that one time. Here's a slash. Now. Fuck it. I didn't get hit. I need a slash. No, oh, shit. Whatever. Shit, I should have saved it too. Final form. And it's the easiest pathetic form ever too. So, uh, I guess... Nah, no, I'll let the game ex explain it. But yeah, you're still fighting the same boss we fought earlier.
He just made that Fugo unconscious so bad that he's like, uh, I turned into a boar for a moment there. And I'm gonna sick chain you. And he's like, no, don't, just stop. You suck with the combos. Unrepentant blade acquired. You see this demon league, you know, those are green barriers. Yep. I was gonna say blue, like, felt like I was gonna go blue, but I remember that in the game, we need to go left, so yeah, green seemed the most obvious. Also, the blue seemed a little bit stronger. おかげで今宵は野宿。慰めに牡丹鍋でも続きながら一杯やるとしようか。化け物の肉なら綱吉の悪法も構えなしだろうよ。さあ、とどめを刺して皮を剥いでくれる。待ってください。山の秘密を包
All right, let's get the hell out of here. コンギ君、今の鳴神で実験を握っておる奴は誰じゃ。たちの行方を知る者はいそうか。海域後は評判の良くない鹿見男女という大官が幕府の直轄領として鳴神藩を仕切っております。鹿見男女と言われましたか。
Damn. She used the Omura Wheatstone. Oh, actually, I did use them all. Neat. I was paying attention to the wheat, the, to the Wheatstones I should be using up. Onto Mino! Mino. And then, if I'm not mistaken, we go to Omi soon after. So, yeah, let's go ask the Magistrate. Alright. Let's see, let's see. Item, I saw you. I saw you. But, so did the monks. They're like, you're not gonna go back there and grab it. Motherfucker. Juggle into a slash of a Chaos Roar. Ah, oh, I didn't get Juggle. I thought I would make. I thought I would reach him in time. And there's my blade. And I thought that would kill him. He was one slash away too. And another Inferno Amulet. I gotta sell these. I'm curious to Fortune Blade, but I do remember this act being the shortest. Like, act three. Could be wrong though. By the way, uh, if you ever, like... Yeah, so, let me grab this real quick. Don't be dissuaded by this area, because you can actually jump on these, and there's usually always spirits on top of this. I actually discovered this rather late, because, uh... When I play games, I sometimes just jump randomly for distance. I assume it gives me the momentum to get further distance, which is obviously not the case. But, uh, yeah, it's not, ex it's not ex uh, explored just yet. I do need to get... Let's see if I get another boss fight in here, actually. But, yeah, don't be dissuaded. I accidentally discovered it. There is some information for you if you ever want to pick up this game, because it's freaking awesome. I think... I think this was a game, but since I already have a, a not a bias, but like a pre-knowledge to this, but this is a game I wouldn't mind being spoiled throughout story-wise because it's mostly action-based. So, but like, there's a lot of games. I said this in a Twitter post for those who are following me on Twitter, like the ten of you, I guess. But it sucks that there are some LPers that I follow that are playing games that I already plan to play, but they're already LPing it, and I want to watch it, but I don't want to get spoilers, you know? One of the games I actually want to LP, the other one's some... Uh, Radical Redcon is doing Nier. I don't know if he's still doing it. Uh, he does cancel some games, if there's, like, no interest between, between him and his viewers. Let me talk to you real quick. God damn you, Rankai Bald Monk! That is a kind of a weird title that rolls off the tongue. But anyways, Radical Redcon does, you know. He cancels some LP series that he's not having fun with and not getting views from what I believe. Which sucks because I was getting into his Lisa LP <laughs> more than his mother LP. But. Eh. Anyways, uh, let's go in here. Oh, and uh, Bog Mod is doing Dead Space 2, and I still need to LP that for this channel because I like Dead Space. Yeah. I'll get to it eventually. Don't mind if I do, sweet little old lady. Alright, so let's talk. While I eat these rashes. So, my name is Jikudo, and uh, I kind of killed my master and my other, uh, what's the word? Adversaries? Oh, wait, sorry, sorry. Colleagues! Uh, okay, well, well, fuck you then. Bet you want to talk about yourself and not me. And why did I give Jinkuro that voice? Or Jinkuro. Ah, whatever. Map, 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 map. And why the fuck not? Crystal Magtama! Woo! I remember using this. But. 5%? Well, I know I said 5% in damage is not a lot. You want the souls! I got a demon necklace. I remember getting that. 
Partial immunity to affliction. Anti-toxin, yeah. Vitality, Tangle Belt, Tangle Mask is strength. And Vitality? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna cook in a bit. Actually, yeah, actually. Special soda, you say? I'm sure, why the fuck not? It looks like a big piece of shrimp. Steam white rice, chilled soba, sukimi udon. Or udon. Boy. When I hear people pronounce that, I hear udon. I think it's udon. I don't know. I got Latin dialects. Actually, did I buy groceries from you because I need groceries? Oh no, you don't sell any. You do sell the rice. Tofu is always good, especially uh, the fried tofu. Buy two of those, two of these, three of these. Cool thing about the real or the money, you don't really you can do you can play the whole game without ever spending any. Which I recommend for like the hardest immersion or whatever the fuck you want to call it. But me, eh. it's a benefit, and I'll take it. It's kind of like the cheap even death spaces. I brought that up. Chicken. Death Space 2 I heard is really different than part 1, so I kind of want to check that out. I know Isaac talks. Babyface Isaac talks, so eh. God damn it, Bogmod, I really want to watch you play it, but... Because I had fun watching you play the first Death Space, but damn. Alright, who else is in here? Mm, no one. Alright. Ugh, and I do want to watch... I've been meaning to play Nier, I just never got to it, so... Hopefully he f Radical Redcon finishes it, so I can watch it after that. I'm not, you know, advertising them. But why would it fucking matter if I did anyways? Eh, let's go down. I'm helping the- wait, what's the word? I'm helping the competition out! Free advertisement, what the fuck, man? Yeah, I'll go with Holy Comet. Especially for these guys. I'm missing Divine Moon. Divine Moon 3 is like 300 attack, I think. Or 200 attack. It's not a great sword in the end. But I use it anyways because I like its ca its capabilities like I mentioned in the second part. Of course it's the first part. Running out of breath. <laughs> Alright. Please be item there because uh, white barrier. Nah. Yep. I knew it. I wanted to doubt it. I had hopes. Oh, there. Yes. Yes. You are a. Irarashi Wheatstone. Eh. I think that one gives you like 100%. No. That one gives you 75% and attack damage. Or slight attack damage increase. I could check, but I'm not going to. It could be entirely, entirely wrong, though. God damn it. White Lightning. Must be in like a scroll. Do 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 do. Boom 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 boom. Going on. Going on to the next area. Mino Narukami Castle main gate. I was stuck here for like hours. No, I'm kidding. Even <laughs> like, that'd be stupid. This place is kind of fun to explore. But yeah, once you reach this place, by the way, these enemies are badass. Uh, they're a lot more rem uh, apparent in the uh, Kisuke story. For good reason, too. These aren't the big enemies I was talking about, but they do help with the long swords. The big enemies I'm talking about are in the next act, I believe. And the next act boss, I think I remember, <laughs> is was kind of hard. Or is it the one before? Or the one after? One of them was hard, like really hard. It could be this act. Yeah, these guys are shooting guns. They're dead spears that shoot guns. It's a useful skill, doesn't do much damage, but it has the range. Alright.
of all the battle themes. Ah, fuck these guys. Ah, I might as well. I already killed one, so I might as well kill the rest. They're like the ninjas in the cave. They reset. Ah, oh, these guys with their big ass stars. They think they're hermits from Maple Story. Uh, I was gonna try to chain that, but I could. One more. I like the pink glow on this sword. Pretty cool. Ah, Rome was there. Actually, no. It's about two more, three more maps to get to. And by that I mean, well actually not maps, but sceneries. Actually, no, wait a minute. That's the seventh deck, I believe. So I remember, yeah, this one's a straightforward one, I believe. Damn, white ninjas. There they are, so that's where they were hiding. Lane sight. Aw. Oh. They had that, uh, what's the word? What's the word for it? Yeah, okay. Ah, uh, what was it called? Marty Dom, there you go. It was like, because I don't, I didn't play a lot, I don't play a lot of Call of Duty. Like I said, I only play one game. That was Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 3. I don't know fucking which one it was, they're all the same to me. One of their perks in the very beginning, it was called Marty Dom. I just, I don't know, I just remember seeing that a lot. I don't know which game it was, but man. It was alright, it was just really hard to play. With my eyes. Everything was blended to the background so well. It was annoying. That's why the kids are so good at it. Ah, oh, fuck, Samurai. Or Shogun. Hey, come on! Ah, fuck, wrong way. Roll away, roll away. Roll away. Whatever. Okay, now I- oh fuck. Okay, so I was trying to roll away and get ready to do the, that circular slash, but... If- the game was acting like I was still trying to roll away, so that was not cool. Radish still gives me quite a bit, actually. And it briefly boosts this enemy encounters. Not right now, as much as I want to, not right now. This is one big floor. Sometimes they have spirit hiding like this. Not it's not really often, but it doesn't hurt to check. An absorb life is gonna help. I am probably gonna forge a heavy blade for this boss battle. No reason in particular, I just wanna use a heavy blade. Item, give me the item. Oh shit. Shogun! The easiest of enemies. Unless you let them stack up on you. Or if you fight like 10 Yukin Joes or something. I wonder if that's like a trial. So you know there's a trial where you fight like multiple bosses, but I don't know if any of them were Yukin Joes, because that would have been fucking hard. Item? Alright. Igarashi Wetster. I find out. Let's find out what it is for. I got another Moro, which is 50. Io is. 40. So yeah, Io should be the. This one should be. No, no, 50 and. 50 of all my swords, okay. I thought that was the one that gives me strength and a recovery of one blade. There we go. This is why I love quick swords. Everything's quick to die. Gotta make sure 
I like how the bat the background is like scaling with your jumps. It's pretty cool. I always wanted one of these screen doors in my room. But I just there's no practicality in them. I was wondering when these guys were gonna appear. Nope, it's not over here. See you back up there. What's in here? It's an item. Two items. A Mantis Gauntlet. Something I could have bought. And I don't know what the fuck other shit was because I opened it too quick. So let's find out. This I'm not gonna need anymore for now. I was holding my nose so I wouldn't sneeze. That's why it sounded so different. So I'm probably gonna want to equip the, uh... Damn it! There you go. I'm probably gonna want to equip. Okay, just want to make sure there were souls there. It could have been more. Probably want to forge a new blade to equip. You guys aren't so tough. However, you do hit hard if you get caught in them. Not like it matters. It's the hardest mode. These guys are trying to be spawn as shit. Okay, I didn't think I was going to kill him in time, it looked like he was actually going to hit me. The music for this area is pretty cool though. Not like in the previous one. I'm bad at the thing. Alright, based on the talking we're going to do and all this shit, I don't think I have enough time. Because I could have finished his act had I not sidetracked a little bit. Tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to forge another play though. Since we got the green one. Let's see, the green one's on the far right, I believe. Yeah, it's right here. You can actually forge this blade and get this one here, which might help. Let's forge this real quick. Flooding Itis! And... Blade of Plum Blossoms! Now I can get this blade right here, but it gives me skull too. Whatever. Blade of Mullet Seas! You're either gonna be getting the purple blade or a blue sword. I really wanna say it's a blue sword, because it's right here. Purple blade's 271. This one's 148, so it makes sense to be this one. Light blue one, anyways. I assume that's it. So these are all the good blades right here. First Moon and Hell's Gate 2, those are pretty good. Qual I eh. Murky Slash, this is a really good blade. This is like a hazy slash, you know? I don't think it's a third one though. Anyways, with that said, thank you for joining me on this part of Let's Play Murumasa. I would like to see you in the next part. However, if you have shit to do, I'm okay with them. You got errands, you got parents calling up to do something, you gotta get that phone number. I don't know, shit happens. But, but yeah, you got the whole week to catch up on this. If you're not watching my other videos, that is Longest Intro so far. Anyways, okay, thanks, bye.